if you're aggravating people's sympathetic autonomic nervous system too much too fast for their individual threshold that's when they start to go vasovagal so vasovagal response you guys is an overreaction of the body to the sympathetics going up too fast the sympathetic start to ramp up the baroreceptors the pressure receptors in your carotids and elsewhere start to start to sense the increased blood pressure and they fire off and then your body overreacts the brain overreacts and it's like whoa no way it cranks the parasympathetics all the way up which more or less turns off the sympathetics for a second plummets your blood pressure your blood pressure goes down and in the most severe instances you pass out People are much, much more likely to pass out if you're doing the pistoning technique on them because you're aggravating their sympathetic nervous system way faster, way more than you do with just inserting the needle once and rotating it. You're not treating nearly as much tissue by doing the pistoning and you're aggravating people way more. So by doing the pistoning technique overall, you're treating less tissue, you're aggravating the sympathetics way more than you need to and the result is far less parasympathetic dominance or far less autonomic nervous system homeostasis than you would get if you did the single insertion technique, rotated the needles and left them. So this is our autonomic nervous system centered approach to needling you guys.